We've got the Demon, which are a light gauge circle hook. So would you use those for both stray lining and ledger fishing? You can use them for both. They're, um, they're popular to use for both styles. They're a bit more user friendly because the fish is essentially hooking themselves. But they work really well on a, a ledger rig. So that makes them also really effective for fishing in deeper water. If you're fishing 20 metres and above, that's when you probably do want to be going to a circle hook. I guess the correct technique with a, a circle hook is, you know, if you're, if you're free spooling it, just into gear and then just slowly let the weight come on. A few winds and a slow lift to, to just get it to slowly roll in, but yeah, definitely no, no strike, whopping yeah. great big strikes, no. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, circle hooks, no striking guys. As much as you want to, you'll lose more fish. Yeah. Okay. So you always want plenty of the, the point um, and the barb protruding just to also help with your hookup rate. And then also you need to match your hook to the bait size. So if you're using smaller little cubes of bait, you know, you could use your, your four burrows. Um, but then if you're using big cup baits or big, you know, jack max or hole baits, then you're going to be going up into your, your bigger eight burrows. If you're using mainline on your reel that's 10 kgs or lighter, these are the types of hooks that you would match up with that. Yeah, yeah we definitely recommend going for a, a lighter gauge hook because you will find that they're just a lot easier to set and it will increase your hookup rate. If you find that you're releasing a lot of fish in a day, um, it's a good idea to, to switch to circle hooks um, just to make sure that those fish are healthy swimming around. Exactly right. Yeah. Conserve the fishery. Absolutely, mate. That's what we're all about.